previously on Canoe York City. I probably canoed like twice before I tried this. <laughs> You're not an Olympic canoeer? No. <laughs> New York. New York. No doubt. Just woke up, just got a copy. I have one more lock, just right ahead. Headed towards Princeton, where the prestigious uh, university is. Maybe try to overnight there, right before Trenton. I, I don't want to camp out in Trenton. I've heard it's kind of a sketchy area, so. About to portage this lock, baby. Last one. Further down the canal, there's so much life, and everything is green. My time here grows shorter with each paddle. I see Frank again, and this time he's brought food and water. Thanks, Frank. <laughs> Great. Trenton is that way. New Brunswick is that way. I came from New Brunswick. Heading to Trenton, baby. Yeah. As I approach the city of Trenton, I'll have to transfer my canoe to a small creek beyond a highway. This creek connects to the Delaware River heading to Philadelphia. Well, that's what I thought at least. So I just crossed Highway 1. the creek I gotta get into. It's gonna get closer to the Delaware River. That definitely took a lot of energy. Pretty much smack dab in the middle of Trent right now. This is a pretty wild ride. Like every corner is a new surprise. I don't know if I'm gonna get spit out to the Delaware, if I'm gonna have to portage. I looked at the map, but it's still unclear. The remnants of old Trenton, a city once thriving, appear alongside the creek. I move through unnoticed, hidden by high walls and abandoned buildings. Approaching the connection to the Delaware, I notice a culvert up ahead. The worst case scenario has become real. The creek moves underground before convening with the Delaware. I cannot go further. friends. Today I'll be rolling my camo canoe through the Trenton, New Jersey hood. All right, let's get started. Forced to portage into the middle of Trenton. I find myself in an unsafe area after turning around on the creek and walking back upstream the day before. It didn't take long before I met Angel a local who helped me fully realize just how dangerous it was to be wheeling a canoe through Trenton. No, it's not a great neighborhood. Not a good Bad neighborhood. neighborhood. Especially to be wheeling a canoe through, huh? Yeah. He recommended we wheel the canoe back to the park where I started to reevaluate my situation. By yourself, you got a boat, and in their mind, you have something that's worth something. You get 
dick up, any of that, man. Right. That's why when I seen you, I told my wife, I said, I'm gonna stop you. I said, man, he can't be from here. Pretty dangerous, man. But yeah, I gotta be careful for sure. So I brought you back from the hood <laughs> to the great area. Cool. Okay. <laughs> I was going straight into the hood on State you Street. You going straight into the rock. Yeah. You know how they say you're going straight into a hard rock? You was going straight into a rock. Woo.